looked at creating this space, the like safe space for teachers with credible, uh, vetted documents. Uh, and especially when it comes to sensitive topics, uh, you know, social justice is issues and so forth. Where am I going? Where's the source of that information? So uh, we have a multitude of resources, some that we've created here at Halton Catholic, some that are uh, provincial documents like Institute for Catholic Education. And we find like a new teacher, you just don't know what you don't know. So we're going to put all these resources there for you alongside the ministry resources. And um, like if you're looking at for assessment and evaluation, growing success is, is the ministry standard. So besides growing success, we'll place growing successfully, which is uh, the Catholic companion. Everything we do, it, it, it starts with Jesus. It starts with our faith. And uh, it's not just adding that layer. So, for example, mentorship. If mentorship is that important component um, for a new teacher, as you know, the ministry obviously states and provides, then our mentorship was to you partner them with uh, a ca another Catholic teacher. Uh, and I think that this module, when you explore those resources together and it points you to these um, uh, sources that are of support, that both the mentor, actually, and the mentee, we feel can benefit. When I started working on this, um, I, I thought about all the possibilities that of uh, things that we could do with our staff. So I do see it as, and the fact that I am a mentor as well. Um, I'm usually the, you know, one of the first people to have a conversation with the new teacher. It might start with that, uh, the, you know, the email from the board where congratulations, you've been assigned to St. Bridget's School, or you've been assigned, you know, welcome to Halton Catholic, and. Uh, uh, you know, just that quick first email, welcome aboard. So the, that new teacher, more often than not, the, the email that comes back is not just thank you, you know, see you in September. It's usually the first couple of emails are, can I ask a quick question? Or, you know, can you help me with this? And can you help me understand that? So it started with um, a lot of what we do even at the school level to provide orientation. I'm most excited, I think, that this is, uh, this is an achievement. I think it's been termed as a legacy project. This is an achievement for Halton Catholic. I'm quite proud of the, uh, I'm proud of our board. We really support teachers. We are one of the few boards, I believe, that fully pays for um, uh, additional qualifications courses when it comes to religion. And I, I believe that this, um, this is a, a combined effort. And Renewing the Promise, again, speaks to all the stakeholders, that every one of us, you know, by virtue of our baptism and the new evangelization, every one of us has a part in Catholic education, whether you're a custodian, whether you're uh, a library technician or a principal, a superintendent. And um, I think that teachers will see, educators will see in this module that it has been a combined effort. You'll see, you know, words of welcome from our director, uh, from all the different individuals, uh, part of our, our Halton Catholic community. That's actually what excites me, the fact that it started out as a small, uh, a small group and a small idea that has involved many partners.